There's this giant big boat. I think they've lost power or something. So they're getting towed. Amy's having to push it off Bears's boat. station to fuel London and it closed down in 1970s and then it lay derelict for years and it's been renovated into a cool new shopping centre that opened last year. There's a lot of fancy shops here, but we've mainly come to look at the building. It doesn't do much, it just makes those lights do that. Oh. There's the lift. <laughs> Never get bored of Lego, but it's so expensive. Do you know our fleeces that we wear all the time? <laughs> this is what they used to look like. It looks like a cloud. This is a different colour. I thought we bought this one. They're just dirty. So Amy, tell us about this thing. One second. <laughs> Why it's the electric switch gear, of course. <laughs> yeah, it looks like a classic electric switch gear to me. It's a circuit breaker dating from 1955. Very large on and off switch designed to control the flow of electricity around the high voltage circuit. Hey, what the hell? It's just that an on and off switch. switch. I should have bought those ones off Amazon that we got. They're much smaller. <laughs> They've got a lot of tiny models of the building that you're in. They love a tiny model, though. Yeah. that's because we're here on a Tuesday afternoon. I can imagine it's quite busy, but the shops are very fancy. But looking at the architecture, if you like that sort of thing, is really, really cool. I swear, every time we come out, you film things with faces on, and that's all the montages. <laughs> Inside of an escalator. Mm. I don't like it. <laughs> What do you make of the recently renovated Battersea Power Station? It's cool. It feels a bit of a shame to make it a shopping centre, but it is a really cool building. And also half of it is residential, which we didn't realise. So like, 
cool roof terraces and stuff like that are basically only for the people that live here. It's cool though. Come back to Borough Market for some food. The trains are going overhead. It's such a cool market underneath the railway tracks and it always smells so good here. Overlooking the tidal Thames, just reminiscing about the fact that we actually took our house on there. That is crazy. Look at this giant boat, and we were amongst them. It's a bit windy though. Mornings are so busy in London, even HMS Belfast has got to double more. That's crazy though that they double more. This one is wild. You shouldn't be here, Swan. He took a wrong turn off the canal, I think. Silly swan. Careful! Representation <laughs> of how it felt to go on that bit, isn't it? So now we've gone under it, we've walked across it, Time to go on this bit! Here we go! Wow! It's a lot of stairs. <laughs> That's only like stage one. Climbing up the Tower Bridge would be involved so many steps. Is that it? I think this is the end. Oh. Whoa. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Are you scared of like? I'm okay up here. It's weird, like I think because there's so many layers of metal between me and just falling and because there's glass windows so there's no wind. I'm all right. What about that Don't appear to be moving. Come on, Wes. Whoa, look! <laughs> That's so true. 
trippy. <laughs> You're having a nice time, Wes? Yes, I'm comfortable and relaxed. <laughs> So well done now. Oh, that was like a jump scare. I thought, oh yeah, this is fine, I can do this. And then literally the floor is just not there. The views are really cool. Is it just the fan? I don't know. I feel like the bridge is squeaking. I think it's just the fan, Wes. I hate it. I want to go down. This is the point bit. My legs are jelly now because I'm just very aware of how high up I am. Whereas before, I didn't really know, so I was fine. Back we go. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. There we are. Wow. That's what it feels like when we <laughs> trying to keep warm in winter. It's so big, isn't it? Yeah. Bit wonky. <laughs> that was really cool. That. Yeah. It was, uh, scarier than I expected. It did it. <laughs> it was only twelve pound fifty as well. So well worth a visit. And you go. Where is it? And you go all the way up there. It was so cool. Really enjoyed that. That was good. That's where we were. It's a shame no one's in it now. Yeah, otherwise you'd be able to see all the feet. There's a pirate ship here! Oh! Pretty tired now, so we're heading back to the boat. We're having a few days on the wall at the Aquavista Limehouse Basin. It's so nice here. Nice being back here. Yeah, definitely. A few more days. The only thing is, it's quite a way down. Nice. Massive thank you for watching this episode. We hope you enjoyed. Huge shout out to the Chip Pals on Patreon and also a big thanks for the chips and a super thanks today from... Rufus Fan, Woof Woof, Claire, Marie, Gizmo and Dora, Juliet, Jenny, David and Ziggy, Katrina, Lee and Tracy, Charlie and Bircham, Karima Rhodes and Shiny Little People. Thank you so much. Check us out on our socials where we post extra content and we'll see you in the next video.